Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two spreads. So I have the gooey hazelnut cocoa spread. And I have the new cinnamon toast crunch creamy cinnamon spread. And I was looking to see if it, what's the base of it, but I didn't see whether what the base is cinnamon or almond or oh, whatever. So we'll you can you'll we'll have, have to look. look. Okay, so the the these were both bought at Kroger. The gooey is a 10 ounce jar and it was $5.99. The Cinnamon Toast Crunch is a 10 ounce jar and it was $3.99. So $5.99, $3.99. So $2 more for that gooey, but we'll talk about it in just a minute when, when Kevin, after Kevin opens it. I just want to see how hard it was going to be. Yeah, and you could go ahead and open that one too if you want to. Okay, so it says gooey hazelnut cocoa spread. It's low sugar dairy free palm oil free uh a better for you so that's probably why it's two dollars more because it's better for you absurdly delicious chocolate hazelnut spread that's perfect on toast smeared on bananas drizzled on ice cream and straight out of the jar uh, all natural gluten-free vegan um manufactured for star day foods i've never heard of that brand mm -hmm. star it's one word star day foods um star day is one more uh scottsdale uh, arizona stardayfoods.com for best results do not refrigerate if the product separates stir to blend if it separates uh, there's 10 servings in the container two tablespoons is 110 calories so the first ingredient is hazelnut butter it's funny yours specifically says no palm oil uh-huh mine has palm oil oh uh, well some people <laughs> Some people I don't care know if that's that. a, I don't know, I don't, I don't know what the deal is. But Some people care about that is, stuff. Is that a bad thing? Or why? Yeah. I don't know. But Kevin and I, clearly, if you watch this channel, we, we do don't look. not give a rip. We just eat. Well, I don't know. I don't know anything about it. Is it unhealthy? Is it, it, it like? Might be. But what do we eat that is not unhealthy? Yeah. Okay. I, I don't so, know. So. I'm saying, I don't know what the deal is with pummel. One has one doesn't. That's all right. Right. I got a big spoon. You did get a huge spoon bowl. Well, I want to really taste it. I was going in hazelnut spread. I'm going in like, like you would comparing it to Nutella. Mm -hmm. That doesn't taste even like it. No. Actually, I would never buy it. <laughs> it's not horrible, but it's not something. It almost has a date-like flavor. Do you, do you have this dates or something like that? It, um, I can see why you would think that. No, it's kind of dark, that dark mm -hmm. um, date flavor. Well, and the texture of it. Yeah, the texture is very thick. The texture is thick like you would get in the center of like a Fig Newton or something. Yeah. And the color and everything is a darker color. I would um, never identify that as hazelnut. No, but that's, I mean, it's hazelnut butter. No, no, um, just, if you were to hand me that and say, what flavor is this? I would never, I would, I would say that was some kind of date based product, figs or something. I do get hazelnut, but it's, it's, um, you can tell it's a healthier version. You can tell that it's lower sugar, um, and that this is something that's, um, healthier. You, you can just tell. Um, would I ever choose this over? A hazelnut spread. Um, Any hazelnut spread. <laughs> uh, no, I wouldn't. But I don't have to worry about um, the uh, it being vegan and low sugar and and palm oil free, dairy free. I don't worry about any of that stuff. I don't care. So if you care, then um, I think it's worth giving it a try. If if you care yeah, about you those like things, it. you might really like it. If you're used to eating other things that um, are free from all that stuff, then this might come across as really yeah. good for you, uh, to, to your taste buds. Since I will eat anything and everything, um, I'm used to the bad stuff, so I like the bad stuff. Yeah, I would rather have this, the main ingredient's brown sugar. <laughs> okay. There is no nut butter in there, by the way. <laughs> Caught me off guard. 
a delicious spread swirled or drizzled on anything it says unlock the awesome taste of cinnamon toast crunch sweet irresistible and spreadable on just about anything this creamy cinnamon spread delivers the epic taste of cinnamon toast crunch with notes of brown sugar and graham flavor amp up your favorite food spread on toast bagels or sliced apples swirl into smoothies oatmeal or yogurt drizzle on pancakes or ice cream uh, it's www.ctcspread.com and made by General uh, License under General Meals. Uh, two tablespoons is 160 calories. So, this is 110 calories. This is 50 more calories, but is it worth the 50 more And it's calories? not, like I said, it's not based on a nut butter. Or you like go that. first. You go ahead. Um, there's no nut butters in there at all. This is a plastic container. This feels glass, doesn't it? Nothing is plastic. You think it's plastic? It's just really thick. No, I think it is plastic. Yeah, it is plastic. It just feels thick. Okay. Yeah, there's no, definitely no nut butters in there. It's also a runnier spread. Whereas that one's really thick and goopy. This is a runnier. This is a product of Greece. That's where they made it. Mm hmm. Um, if you like cinnamon, you got cinnamon. I mean, that would be, that'd be good putting over top of, you know, the cinnamon roll when you make a cinnamon roll, the glaze on top. Yeah. That would make a really good topping for cinnamon rolls. Uh, a toaster strudel. A toaster strudel. Yeah, that'd be good. They came out with the cinnamon toast crunch toaster strudels. That would be awesome on. As the glaze. But, um, if, if I had the choice between, if you're going to eat it right out of the jar or if you're going to add it to something then go big or go home right so i would rather have the actual frosting yeah the frosting sweeter the frosting is, yes <laughs> the frosting that you get in the cake owl uh kevin pointed it out to a lady the other day he's like That's well she was looking at the cake mix and i said that frosting really yeah you gotta have the frosting with it and the frosting you can put the frosting on a ritz cracker just as yeah. well as the spread i think this spread is really really good it is good it's a different texture than the frosting would be. it is it's not as thick yeah, I it, think it's this literally be, more like a glaze i think it'll be easier to spread so like if you have a piece of a hot piece of toast you know you just got it out of the toaster and, and you're going to spread that on there i think this is going to spread a lot mm. thinner and easier um, now, putting it in oatmeal would be easier. Yes, putting it on a pancake. I mean, anything like that. Anything, a, a, a pancake. Wow, that's a great Waffle. idea. I love the idea with a pancake. That would be delicious. Um, so, yes, of course, it is going to be easier to spread. Which one is sweeter? The frosting is sweeter, but that is still delicious it's, bread. It's good, yeah, mm -hmm. but it's, it's primarily cinnamon. Cinnamon. Yeah. You get more cinnamon than sugar. Yeah, I don't really get the graham flavor at all. Maybe it's mixed in there a little bit, but. Whereas the frosting, I think you get more sugar than cinnamon. I yeah. think it's flipped it's with the frosting. It's just a cinnamon, yeah. Um, but. I do um, think it's good though. Yeah, three ninety nine. I think that's a good price. And I love it. the picture on the front. They're, they're using like, what, 10 tablespoons of, of spread on that piece of toast? <laughs> It is. The, the, this thick. piece of toast, yeah, that is how every person wants to eat their piece of toast. It's like 300 calories worth of spread on there. Yeah, on one piece of toast. But that would be all you would yeah. need for at least a few hours. But out of the two, I would definitely get this one. That one really just didn't, didn't there's other products out there that I hate that I like better. Yes, um, and like we said, we don't care. Yeah, we're not vegan, so we don't. Yeah, we, we don't care about the us. ingredients and the oils yeah. and stuff like that. So if you don't care, why not go ahead and, and, and get this? But I'm glad we got to try something. Yeah, today. yeah. It was fun to try. It wasn't horrible. It's just different. It's just different. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.